Baby Browning pistols were manufactured by Fabrique Nationale in Belgium from about 1931 to 1979. The early ones had grips that were marked FN. In around 1958 or so, the grip design was changed to uh, Browning for those versions to be imported into the United States. Uh, the importation was short-lived. I believe it began around 1960. But, of course, the passage of the Dodd Control Bill, a.k.a. the 1968 Gun Control Act, banned the importation of these. However, Browning did continue to manufacture them for sale outside the United States until 1979. The rights to the make the pistol in the United States were transferred to a company called PSA, uh, which was licensed by Belgium to, by Fabrique National rather, to uh, make licensed copies of it. There were problems initially the PSA produced pistols uh, were intended for export to Austria to be distributed by Fabrique National. However, the export permit was denied by the United States State Department. The PSA, I believe, continues to make these. There is also an aluminum frame version uh, which both Fabrique Nationale and PSA made. Uh, Fabrique Nationale used 6061. I believe the uh, PSA version uses 7075 aluminum. Uh, don't know what else to tell you. Like I said, uh, Bauer made copies of it without license, but they made changes in theirs to try and evade any lawsuits and their version. The changes they made are not nearly as reliable as the original FN Browning versions. I can attest that previously I owned a Bauer version. I called it a jammatic because I could never get to fire more than two shots without a jam. Whereas this actual Browning version... No rapid fire, it'll fire consistently. As long as you got magazines, it will feed and chamber everything you throw in there. And 25 ACP, of course. Anyway, if you like this pistol, uh, this video, and want me to be able to make more of them, please consider becoming a Patreon supporter. Also, press like if you like this video, and consider subscribing. I hope to come up with more videos of interest to the rest of you uh, sometime soon. Thank you. Magazine holds six shots, 25 automatic. Magazine release, there's a tab at the bottom. The pistol, now loaded, has a six round magazine, which also has a thumb safety. These were extremely popular when they were first introduced. They remain popular overseas in the United States. The Browning 25 had a very good reputation. And is not prone to jamming. Now I'll show you how to field strip it and clean it. Browning 25 is actually a fairly simple pistol to disassemble. First step is remove the magazine. Now, pull the slide back and with the thumb safety, lock it to the rear. Check the chamber. Chamber is empty. With the slide locked back, Rotate the barrel. Release the slide lock. The barrel slides out. The 
stride car is also removable. The striker assembly. There's a little tab on the striker when you put it back in. Be sure to line up that tab. I'll right, we'll put this here for right now. Here we have the recoil spring and the guide rod. I do not recommend disassembling these parts further. But you can, of course, uh, wash them in oil or uh, hops nine as you see fit. And that's your basic pistol. And now I'll clean this one and reassemble it. This Browning 25 has been cleaned. Reassembly is fairly simple. I like the Coke 1903 and other Browning designs. Insert the barrel into the slide. Find the spot at which the barrel can be turned. Turn the barrel. Insert the slide or make the slide to the frame thusly. Slide it back and lock it in position with the safety. Turn the barrel back so that the lug is on the bottom. Your pistol is now reassembled. Notice that the cocking indicator is not protruding because the pistol did not cock because the magazine was out. Reinsert the magazine. Cock it again. Notice the cocking indicator is out. Test the safety. Nothing happens. Remove the safety. The gun will fire. This pistol is ready for loading and carrying again usage if needed. If you like this picture, if you like this video, please consider contributing to my Patreon account. Please like and subscribe. Have a good day.